time and glory. The mixtape. They say life is just a gamble. Death is but a dream. Thoughts are past with expected being broke from a fiend. So much pain bottled inside of me. Make it hard What's up, everybody? This is your boy Christian Page. You're tuned into the one year anniversary of The Edge. Um, so, or, you know, it started off as your daily dose and then it turned into the edge. So, thanks for tuning in. I know I look a mess. I'm working on trying to get everything, take, um, you know, tighten up and look better for you guys. But, thanks for tuning in. And for a very, very special one year anniversary, I had, I am reviewing the one, the only Ty Gutta out of Baltimore, y'all, with his brand new mixtape, The Complex Mind Theory. Um, which is totally off the chain. This is probably the most anticipated mixtape mix of the year. Um, and I am really excited. So let me get right down to it uh, and, and get into what are my favorite tracks and why. And why you should go out and buy this mixtape because it is the ish. Alright? <clears throat> Oh, and if I'm, any of you wondering, like, why is your hair so long? Because I'm about to lock it back up. But I might be not doing it, so let's just, just, just move on. All right, so here we go. The very first track is the actual title track from the entire mixtape. It's called The Complex Mind 3. Really, 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 really thought for folk. I have to say this. Ty gives you a great... Um, if you see Ty, you would not think that was his voice um, on most of the tracks. But it's the shit. So anyway... Ty give you a very, very great detail and graphic storyline and everything throughout this entire mixtape. I love the complex mind theory. It's not my favorite, but I like I think it's a great way to start off the entire um the entire mixtape. Now let's drop down to number three, hand on my gun. Hand on my gun is my joint. Now it's only a minute and nineteen seconds, but I like it. And at first I thought it was a skit. It kind of seems like it might be a skit because it's so short, but I really like it. I, I just kind of like the vibe that I get from it. Um, my next track, let's drop down to number six. My Words. I did something on this a little while ago um, and forever a little while ago. And it, though I love those joints. If we drop down to number 10, uh, no, we drop down to number 11, We Ride. That is a favorite of one of my partners. They love that joint. Now, I'm going to be honest and tell you which one I really like because I just think it's, um, well I have two favorites and I have these two favorites because I just can't decide which one I have one favorite, but 14 and 15, 14 is turn my shit up, which I always say turn my shit up, turn it up, when I'm in the studio, turn my shit up in the head so I can hear it. Um, and number 15, Free Bars, because Free Bars seem like a freestyle. And I have to say this, Ty has a really great lyrical take on a lot of stuff. Um, I like an artist, or I like a rapper that I can hear and understand. And at the same time, I like a rapper that give me stories and let me, you know, and wine and dine, not wine and dine me, but take me on a nice ride. Ty is able to do that. I don't find too many artists that I really like that are rappers, and there's a very, very few. If you notice, I probably have only interviewed or reviewed maybe six rappers on the entire show. No more than ten. Um, and those that I really do review or I do review on, I must really, really like your stuff because you obviously have something a little more in-depth and, you know, a little quality to what you're trying to do. So, um... Free Bars is my shit. I, that's my favorite. I think Free Bars is probably my favorite out of the entire um, mixtape. Um, it's one of the shorter tracks on the entire mixtape, but it's a good, good track. If you go down to Hate Me, Pretty Panties On, and um, Motion Picture. Motion Picture is sick too, y'all. Let me say this. Motion Picture isn't what I thought it was going to be. I thought it was going to be a little more cinematic. But it is very, really, really dramatic. It's a lot of drama feel too. It's the, it's the music that gets you though. It's the music that gets you. It's a little drama feel, a little in depth, a little. Um, you just gotta get it. Let me just say this: He doesn't have a lot of um, features on this. Um, Stacy Rose is the features. Em, Em, Infamous Goon is also on here. Cruzon is on here. Hunted Proof is on here. Stacey Rose appears again. And of course, Cherry Lala is featured on the Baltimore Anthem, Baltimore, Baltimore. So if you haven't had a chance to hear it, just, you know, do that. Um, I don't know exactly where Ty is releasing the mixtape. 
y'all, but be sure to check out iTunes, Amazon, CD Bay, datpiff.com, and of course, um, hit your boy up on Facebook, um, link him up, Ty Gutter, I'm pretty sure he'll give you all the information you need. Um, but I'm gonna say this, my, one more track that stands out to me, and I didn't think it would, but when I was listening to the CD again today, uh, because I was getting ready to do the review, um, I just couldn't get over it, I played it like six times back to back because it's the bomb, and that's Got Till It's Going. I just freaking love it, I love it, and in all honesty, I have a feeling that Ty did this because it's somebody to him, or someone to him, or something of that, that nature that you know you just don't realize you got till it's going and it's a beautiful track and rappers don't really give you too many um feelings and emotions in a lot of their songs but this one right here ty put his heart into it and you can really really feel it so if i had to pick a number two track it would be got till it's gone so overall though i give this cd i give this mixtape a 10 um and the only thing that I would say about the CD that about the mixtape that I really didn't like is that some of the tracks seem like they would flow right into the next track, but when it didn't flow into the next track, I was kind of disappointed because it just it made really good it made a really good groove to it, like you know just ride around out into the very next track and you can just keep right on jamming. But of course, I'm pretty sure Ty has a whole lot more up his sleeve, and I'm pretty sure I can't wait to see what's coming from in the near future. So y'all be sure to check my boy out, Ty Gutter. T-Y-G-U-D-D-A on Facebook and check me out as well, Christian A. Page. Look me up. Facebook me. Subscribe to the YouTube show and y'all promote this joint. Go out and get the, um, get the Complex Mind Theory from Ty Gutter, y'all. I love it. I love it. I love it. And uh, I'm just going to say this real quick. My boyfriend, which if you didn't know, I'm gay. My boyfriend um, is really hard on the independent artists and what they do and and, um, and and stuff like that. But when he likes independent artists, he likes them. And Ty Gutter is one of those artists that he really, really likes. So Ty, big ups and shout out to you because you got two brand new fans. I'm looking forward to the album and complete. Um, and y'all stay tuned for more from the Edge, y'all. Once again, thanks for tuning in. Happy anniversary to me because the Edge is now one year old, all right? Thanks and shout out to everybody for um, supporting the Edge all these this whole entire year. Um, stay tuned for the credits to find out who those very, 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 very special people are. And much love to everybody. I'm out. Pain, time, and glory. The mixtape. They say life is just a gamble. Death is but a dream. Thoughts.